हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू प्राइस यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज स्कॉलरशिप एग्जाम स्टैंडर्ड फिफ्थ ऑनलाइन क्लास सब्जेक्ट इंटेलिजेंट टेस्ट एंड द मेन टॉपिक इज लॉजिकल रीजनिंग एंड दियर द सब टॉपिक इज वर्बल इन वर्बल देर आर द थ्री टाइप्स एज रिलेशनशिप एंड द अदर्स देर आर द सम एग्जाम्पल्स आर ऑल्सो वी आर गोइंग टू कवर सो दिस वीडियो इज स्पेशली फॉर द दिस वर्बल्स दिस थ्री टाइप्स वी विल गोइंग टू सी वट एक्जैक्टली द स्टूडेंट हैज टू डू मोस्टली थ्रू द एग्जाम्पल्स दिस कॉन्सेप्ट एंड द फंडामेंटल्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी सो वट एक्जैक्टली द लॉजिकल रीजनिंग इज सेज so in a logical reasoning there are the some questions under this one uh, the it helps the develop our reasoning or the logical thinking about some tricks are there okay so sometimes of the questions so we have to understand what exactly the information on the information basis we have to give the proper answers this is the main so for this one the uh, these puzzles uh, need to solve and for this one the logical approach should be necessary so for this mainly the information has to be understand properly this is the mainly one uh, method okay so there is no formula or we can say there is no any tricks also only the questions are giving some information that information we have to think and logically we have to give the answers so in that one the age comparisons and the word substitution and the relation these are the four main types so in a age there are the some uh, comparison between two uh, persons age okay or we can say there is the giving the difference or we can say the uh, date also sometimes given and from that one we have to calculate the particular current date suppose there is asking in a questions current date or we can say the difference like this one or we can say in a future or something after years how much uh, the their uh, age should be that that persons like this one this type of the questions may be asked so for this one the practice should be must okay and the student must be do the more uh, practice for this one and maximum problems has to solve then only this type of the uh, means uh, topics we will get clarifications okay and then comparison means uh, in this one sometimes the height or we can say the size of the different objects or the person's uh, uh, age also sometimes make a comparisons or the uh, means their height also um, sometimes the two persons comparison sometimes the distance between the two cities or we can say the places or the objects uh, shapes or sizes this type of the comparison is given and on that basis some questions are asking so for this one also we have to read problem very carefully and uh, give the prop con correct con conclusion or we can say the answer for the exactly uh, what the exactly in asking in a question so that should be in a logical thinking way and in a word substitution so sometimes that is a logical already the approach is given means uh, there is a conditions are given suppose uh, one things are one uh, means animals or sometimes persons names are interchanging for the just moment and on that basis some uh, logical questions are asking so all these types are the mainly cover in this uh, verbals and last one is the relation so relations means the um, persons relations okay or we can say the information basis so that information we have to analyze and on this one basis we have to use our knowledge what exactly the uh, relations names i mean sometimes where uh, such as the aunt then auntie then cousin nephew then sister in law like this one these are the relations name so these are the relations names should be uh, keep in your knowledge and for this one you must be uh, know all these ones and reading is must for this one to get it the more and more information so please student read more and more relations names okay so we will see all these type of the four types through the some example because only there is a one way to understand this topic is that one more and more problems we have to solve more and more uh, examples we have to understand okay so the question number 1 is here camel is called elephant this is one sentence then elephant is called tiger tiger is called lion lion is called giraffe then which is the national animal so now see the first name means here now camel is called elephant now calling name is interchanging but the animal is same okay means camel is not calling now camel now for a moment we are calling it a, as a elephant and the element that animal elephant but that for the calling purpose just now we are calling as a tiger like this one tiger is called lion lion is called 
जिराफ सो नॅशनल अॅनिमल वी नो द नॅशनल अॅनिमल इज द टायगर अँड टायगर दॅट अॅनिमल इज कॉलिंग ॲज अ लायन सो लायन इज गिवन इन ऑप्शन नंबर फोर सो फोर ऑप्शन ऑप्शन नंबर फोर इज अ करेक्ट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर टू प्रिंटर इज कॉल्ड कीबोर्ड कीबोर्ड इज कॉल्ड माउस माउस इज कॉल्ड स्पीकर देन वॉट विल बी द यूज फॉर टायपिंग सो ॲज वी नो द टायपिंग इज डुईंग बाय द कीबोर्ड बट द कीबोर्ड धिस ऑब्जेक्ट इज नाव वी आर नॉट कॉलिंग ॲज अ कीबोर्ड वी आर कॉलिंग इट ॲज अ माउस ओके सो ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री इज अ करेक्ट नाव क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इफ चेअर इज कॉल्ड टेबल टेबल इज कॉल्ड नोटबुक नोटबुक इज कॉल्ड पेन पेन इज कॉल्ड इरेझर देन वेअर यू विल यू राईट वी आर रायटिंग ऑन टेबल नो देन ऑन पेन ऑन इरेझर नो वी आर रायटिंग ऑन अ नोटबुक ओके बट द नोटबुक धिस ऑब्जेक्ट इज नॉट कॉलिंग ॲज अ नोटबुक नाव वी आर कॉलिंग इट ॲज अ पेन सो हियर द नोटबुक इज अ पेन मीन्स ऑप्शन नंबर टू पेन इज अ करेक्ट वन सो वी विल राईट ऑन अ पेन लाईक दिस वन दिस इज द मिनिंग ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन सो नाव क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर रमेश इज टॉलर दॅन गणेश ओके सो दिस इज द इन्फॉर्मेशन सो सपोज वी आर सेईंग दॅट कम्पॅरिझन बिट्वीन दिस वन सो फ्रॉम शॉर्टर ऑर टू द टॉलर लाईक दिस वन वी आर मेकिंग द सम कम्पॅरिझन बेसिस सो रमेश हियर सपोज द रमेश अँड देन द गणेश ही आर द गणेश ओके सो ही आर द गणेश जी फॉर द गणेश अँड आर फॉर द रमेश सो रमेश इज टॉलर ओके सो दिस इज द ॲरो वी आर सिंग दॅट फ्रॉम द शॉर्टर टू द टॉलेस्ट पर्सन ओके सो रमेश इज टॉलर दॅन द गणेश सुरेश इज टॉलर दॅन द रमेश नाव सुरेश इज टॉलर दॅन द रमेश सो रवी इज टॉलर दॅन द सुरेश नाव आफ्टर द सुरेश अगेन रवी इज देअर अँड रवी इज टॉलर दॅन द सुरेश हु इज द टॉलेस्ट बॉय सो रवी इज अ टॉलेस्ट बॉय सो रवी इज गिवन इन ऑप्शन नंबर फोर ना क्वेश्चन नंबर फाय मँगो इज चिपर दॅन बनाना बनाना इज कॉस्टलियर दॅन ॲपल सो दिस मिनिंग इज दॅट मँगो इज चिपर दॅन बनाना मीन्स बनाना इज कॉस्टलियर दॅन मँगो अँड ॲपल ऑल्सो नाव विच इज द कॉस्टलियर फ्रूट नाव इन बिट्वीन दिस थ्री फ्रूट्स बनाना इज अ कॉस्टलियर बिकॉज मँगो इज चिपर दॅन बनाना मीन्स बनाना इज कॉस्टलियर दॅन मँगो अँड बना बनाना इज कॉस्टलियर दॅन ॲपल ऑल्सो मीन्स दॅट इज द ॲपल अँड मँगो आर द चिपर दॅन द बनाना मीन्स अनदर वे वी कॅन से बनाना इज अ कॉस्टलियर अँड बनाना दिस इज गिवन इन ऑप्शन नंबर टू Now question number 6 in marathi anamika scored less marks than shilpa so we will say that this is the uh, arrow we can say the maximum marks here we will just maintaining and here the minimum marks okay so now here the uh, in marathi this is a suppose marathi subject okay now no anamika scored less marks than shilpa means shilpa is scored more marks okay so shilpa s for shilpa here and anamika a for here so anamika is lesser than mar- lesser marks and shilpa is getting more marks or this is the saying the maximum toward the maximum arrow we are showing then shilpa scored more marks than savita now shilpa is uh, scored more marks than savita means some, somewhere here savita also there okay so, yes so s a we are ma- uh, denoting so silpa is uh, here more marks in between the comparison between anamika and the savita now savita scored less marks than anamika so savita will be here less than marks than anamika so s a will will write down here okay then who scored lowest marks okay so who scored lowest now here as per the this one the savita is scored lowest mark so option number 3 is the correct one question number 7 ajit is taller than salim so we will just making the bar chart s for salim and ajit s a for the ajit now ajit is taller than salim so salim height we will show just like this bar so it is a shorter so salim is a shorter than ajit or we can say ajit is a taller than salim okay now ajit is shorter than john means of course john height is more than the ajit okay so this is a john height then rahim is taller than john so after the johns means john also shorter than the rahim so rahim is a taller than the john so r for the rahim now who is the shortest now from these four persons salim is a shortest and salim means option number 2 is a correct one now question number 8 pointing to a girl vibo said her father calls my mother mummy 
how is vaibho related to the girl now vaibho is pointing a one girl and saying that her father so suppose here the v is a vaibho and g for that girl okay so now what is said her father so her father we will just denoting like a f her father is called my mom's means vaibho's mom as a mummy okay so vaibho's mom telling as a mummy okay so means that the her father uh is a uh, vaibho's mother okay means that one the her father and vaibho are both are the brother okay so how is vaibho related to the, to that girl means vaibho is uncle of that girl so uncle means option number 1 now question number 9 pointing toward a photo tanuja said this girl is daughter of my mother's sister so pointing to the uh, photo so suppose here the one photo and tanuja we will denote as a t so she said that this girl is a daughter of my mother sister so tanuja's mother we will show as a m and then her sister and then this girl is a daughter means that sister's girls like this one so how is the girl in a photo related to the tanuja so this relations we can say so we can say the daughter of daughter of sister of mother okay means tanuja's mother's sister's daughter this is the meaning so option number 3 is the correct now question number 10 anita's father is sima's maternal uncle so suppose a for anita and s for sima's so anita's father is sima's maternal uncle so father and here also the father okay so here the maternal uncle means of coursely the mother's brother okay so this is the meaning so this f for father and m for mother how is sima's mother related to anita so sima's mother related to the anita so sima's mother we will showing as a m and anita so this relations we have to find out so this relations means auntie okay so means aunt is option number 2 is a correct one now question number 11 Ajit told Suraj your father is my father's only sister's husband so Ajit a for Ajit okay and s for Suraj so what is uh, telling to the Suraj your father so f for father so your father is my father's only sister's husband so means Suraj mother is a sister of her father okay means Ajit father okay this is the relation between the um, uh, sujit's mother and ajit's father is that there are the uh, sister and the brother so now how is ajit related to the suraj so means that one is the ajit is related to the suraj means this is the relation between uh, Aj, suraj and ajit is that from the mother means we can say the maternal cousin okay so option number 4 is the correct one now question number 12 4 years ago shreya was 12 years old so 4 years ago 4 years ago means we will just mention towards the left side so this is a suppose this is the current current time okay or we can say the current year so 4 years back the shreya's age was the 12 years okay 3 years hence what will be her age so means in a future 3 years later what will be her is that is the meaning so 4 years ago that was the 12 years old so now 12 plus 4 means she is a 16 years old and in a question asking 3 years hence what will be her age so after 3 years means 16 and plus 3 means it's a 19 years so 19 years means option number 3 is a correct one now question number 13 the sum of the ages of aruna and vaibhavi is 30 this is 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 35 years aruna is older than vaibhavi by 5 years what is the aruna's present age so a for aruna and v for vaibhavi so both the age addition is 35 but the relation between their age also has given that aruna is older than vaibhavi by the 5 years so what we will do first we will subtract this 5 from this 35 so that will becomes the 30 and after this one both the ages are now equal means divided by 2 so 15 now 15 is a age of the vaibhavi okay and 15 plus 5 means age of the aruna 
so now in a question what is the aruna's age means 15 plus 5 means 20 years so option number 4 is the correct now question number 14 geeta's present air age is um, 15 years and sushmita's present age is 19 years find the difference between the ages of the geeta's and sushmita's after five years or we can say the five years hence means the difference between the ages are always be th throughout in a life are the same this present age is the uh, 19 and the 15 so their age is the uh, difference is the four currently and after the five years also the, the difference between the age also be four okay so means the four means option number three is the correctly now question number 15 shubham is six six years younger than Vignesh, some of their ages is 30 years. Find the present age of the Vignesh. So this question is somewhat be same like a question number 13. So the Shubham age is six years younger than the Vignesh. So and their sum is the 30. So we will mention or we can say the denotion S for the Shubham and the V for the Vignesh. So S plus V is equals to 30 is given and the difference between there is the 6 means anger uh, Shubham is the anger than the Vignesh or we can say the uh, Vignesh is uh, having the age uh, 6 years more than the Shubham so first of all we will deduct 6 from this uh, 30 so 30 minus 6 is comes the 12 so 12 is the age of the Shubham and 12 plus this 6 is the age of the why weakness so this weakness age is the 18 so in a question asking what find the present age of the weakness and weakness age is the 18 so option number two is the correct thank you